Hello everyone. Welcome to Catchy English. In this video we will learn some of the most common words in English. At the beginning we will see all the catchy pictures of the words one by one. Then there will be some exercises about them. And also, a story that contains these words is waiting for you at the end of the video. Well then, let's jump right in. Celebration. Celebration. We had a joyful celebration with friends and family for my birthday. Departure. Departure. We gathered at the airport to bid farewell to our friend before her departure. Dictionary. Dictionary. I use a dictionary to look up the meanings of new words. Flexible. Flexible. The garden hose is flexible, making it easy to water plants in tight spaces. Limited. Limited. The special offer is for a limited time only, so don't miss out. Party. Party. The costume party at school was a fun and creative event. Propose. Propose. He plans to propose to his girlfriend on their anniversary. Solve. Solve. Emily had a brilliant idea to solve the problem. Thank. Thank. I want to thank my parents for their unconditional support. Together. Together. The community came together to support a local charity. All right. Choose the correct picture that belongs to word below. Departure. Celebration. Flexible. Party. Limited. In this part, I want you fill the blanks in the sentences with the suitable words. We're hosting a small dinner party to celebrate our recent achievements. The team collaborated to solve the complex problem and find a solution. I want to sincerely thank you for your generous support. The yoga instructor emphasized the importance of maintaining a flexible body. The store offers a limited edition of the product for collectors. Well done. Let's fill the gaps to complete the words.
Celebration. Dictionary. Departure. Propose. Together. And now, it's story time. Please listen it carefully and try to catch the words that we learned in this video. I will have a question for you at the end of the story. Once upon a time in a small village, there lived a young couple named Anna and Tom. They were known for their flexibility and willingness to solve problems together. One day, Tom decided to propose to Anna, and the whole village was buzzing with excitement in anticipation of the celebration. Tom had planned a surprise party for Anna, and he had invited all their friends and family to join the festive occasion. The limited space in their cozy home made the party a bit crowded, but everyone was happy to be part of this special day. Before the celebration began, Tom presented Anna with a beautifully wrapped gift. As she opened it, she discovered a shiny new dictionary. Anna was puzzled at first, wondering why Tom had chosen such an unusual gift for this momentous occasion. With a smile, Tom explained, this dictionary represents the flexible nature of our relationship. Just like words can have different meanings, we too can adapt and grow together. Let's always be open to new possibilities and ideas. Anna was touched by Tom's thoughtful words and thanked him with a warm hug. The departure of any doubts she had about their future together was a cause for celebration, and the party kicked off with laughter and joy. As the night unfolded, the couple danced, laughed, and enjoyed the company of their loved ones. The limited space didn't hinder the festive spirit, instead, it made the celebration feel intimate and special. The dictionary, a symbol of their flexibility, became a cherished part of their home. Whenever they encountered challenges, they would turn to it, finding ways to solve problems together. The dictionary wasn't just a book of words. It became a guide to navigating the twists and turns of their shared journey. From that day forward, Anna and Tom continued to celebrate their love, their flexibility, and their ability to solve problems together. Their departure from ordinary routines marked the beginning of a life filled with gratitude and happiness. And that's the end of the story. Here is the last question. How did Tom use the dictionary as a symbol of the flexibility in his relationship with Anna? Leave your answers in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay updated on all of our latest content. Keep practicing your English skills and stay tuned for more exciting videos coming soon. See you next time.